Next step is to remove this wireless charging coil. I already apply some heat from the back and from little from the front. Now I'm going to carefully pry this up. To transfer the charging coil, we need to remove these brackets. I think they are uh, volume buttons. I don't know what they are. Anyways, I'm going to remove them all and transfer this whole charging coil unit. But if you are in a case where you have to just transfer the charging coil unit, not those flex cables and buttons, then you will need to desolder this charging coil from that flex little flex cable and then transfer it to a new housing or new phone do you see the little flex cable on the top of the charging coil we need to disorder that then we have to solder this again on a new phone or to a different iPhone X all right let's disorder this charging coil from that little flex cable I will apply some heat and then carefully remove that soldered flex cable from the charging coil always you need to use flux for easy work be patient and be careful cable is disordered now we just need to clean it up and I'm gonna apply some solder on those three pins I am kind of tinning it. Looks perfect. Now this charging coil is ready to be transferred. All you need to do is placing the charging coil on a different phone and reconnect, I mean resolder that little three pin flex cable to it. I'll show you how to resolder that three pin flex cable to this charging coil. First thing you need to do is aligning it correctly. Once your alignment is correct, apply some flux and solder the pins one by one. It doesn't look that good, so I am trying it one more time. More flux and more heat. Looks great. That's it. You have successfully transferred a charging coil from your old phone to your new iPhone X. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. We'll do our best to answer your questions as soon as possible. For more videos like this, you can subscribe to our channel. And thank you for watching.